What's going on YouTube? Sunday fun day. Tasting another beer. Gonna watch a little football. Today we're going with another treehouse offering. This one's lights on. Um, I looked up the name. I, I couldn't find it on their website, but I remember when I had it out, out that it had something to do with the, when they actually, I guess, fired up the brewery, turned the lights on. So this was canned. I got this on a canning day. 1013. It says live wild. So it's an American Pale Ale, 5.6% alcohol. I've had this one before. It's quite good. Get it in the glass. Ah, uh, yes, that typical New England aroma. But this one's got a little more fruit that I'm picking up. That typically from some of their beers that I've had, people go crazy for. And not to say they're bad beers, but I just don't pick up a lot of the same things. Some of them taste very similar to me. Uh, probably the best beer that I've had from them, although I'm a hobby beer guy, was their Double Shot which was an espresso stout, I've had a couple times, fantastic. Uh, of their hoppy beers, you know, their flagship is Julius, I've had that, green, uh, haze. Um, they do a couple blonde ales with the, that are hopped up a little bit. So I've had their alter ego and their, some of their curiosity series, which those were my favorite in the hoppy beer category, the alter ego. And I had curiosity 16, I think they're up to like 23 would be the next one coming out, so. Yeah, just really citrusy, orange, grapefruit uh, that smells fantastic. Get it in the glass. Beautiful looking beer. Just the orange color, nice white head, about a uh, finger's worth. It's just a fantastic looking beer. Yeah, you're just getting that. To me, this is this is to me what I love in an American Pale Ale or an IPA. Just that juiciness, uh, that juicy citrus aroma that I've not seen in a few of them that I've had lately. Um, but it's just just awesome smelling. Cheers. Yeah, I mean you are getting orange juice. A uh, little bit of bitterness, but not not much at all. The bitterness in this one is not uh, at the forefront. Kind of comes around in the middle, fades pretty quick, finishes nice and clean. This is just a fresh tasting, juicy beer. Um, again, their beers are not widely distributed. I guess there's some spots in Mass that have them on tap. You have to go to the brewery to get it and trade. I mean, the traders are out there. Um, I recently traded with a guy from California, got some West Coast beers, but man, this is just fantastic. If you have a chance to get it, give it a shot. It's delicious. Cheers. Delicious. Talk to you later.